In this Android Studio tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create this dialog box where you can click yes or essentially no. It depends on what you want your actions to be. But first, let's go to our XML file and create a button. You can just change the text view to a button and define an ID. I just called it button alert to keep things simple. Then you want to change this placeholder text to something the button does or refer to like open alert or whatever it does, reset settings, I don't know. Then you want to write button dot, uh, write button button at the top and initialize it by doing button equals find view by id r dot id button alert. Then we're gonna click, uh, we're gonna type button dot set on click listener and write new view on click listener to make sure the button can be tapped. And we're gonna create an alert dialog and we're gonna write alert dialog dot builder my alert builder. You can write whatever you want there, but that's just a comfortable name, let's say, and equals new alert dialog dot builder. And we're gonna use the context main activity dot this. Next, we're gonna write my alert builder dot set title and write whatever title you prefer. And we're gonna do the same for the message my alert builder dot set message. This is a message. And finally, we're gonna actually create the buttons my alert builder dot set positive button. I wrote yes, and we're gonna write a new dialog interface on click listener. Then I just inserted a toast message. To keep things simple, if you click on it, it will say you clicked yes. Then we're going to do the exact same thing for the negative button, right? My alert builder dot set negative button, right? No, and then write a new dialog interface on click listener. Then we're going to make another toast, and it's just going to say no, and it's going to say you clicked no. And those are essentially the two options that are there. I'm sure you can add in extra options. I would definitely play around with all the options it gives you. And make sure at the bottom you write my alert builder dot show because the dot show is very important that you actually want your dialog box to show. Yeah, here it is. We click on open alert. It will say this is a message. We say no, it's not. Or we can go and say yes, this is a message, whatever you prefer. But that is essentially all there is to creating an alert dialog box.